A snowplow narrowly missed two school buses before losing control and sliding into four cars. See here, it was all caught on camera in Antioch showing just how dangerous the roads were today. News Channel 5's Jesse Knutson is at the crash scene along Apollo Drive with the details. Hey, Jesse. Well, the good news is that no one was injured in this crash, but there were some cars that received quite a bit of damage from that snowplow snow crash. Now, we also learned today that the buses were carrying special needs students and were stuck on this road for about four hours. Oh, my God! A mission to rescue two school buses stranded on Apollo Drive did not go as planned this morning. I was freaking out. <laughs> I was not expecting that. As a snowplow headed down the hill with plans to plow snow and lay down salt, it lost control and started slipping. Nope, nope, nope. And there they go. There they go. At the bottom of the hill, the snowplow hit four cars. I immediately stopped video and called 911, but my husband walked down and um, let me know so I could let 911 know that no one was injured, thankfully. And I didn't get much damage, so that was good. Those in the car said they were trying to get up the hill, but were having little to no luck. When the snowplow um, hit me, I had already put the car in reverse to go back down the hill. The good news in all of this is that the school buses on the hill carrying five special needs students were missed by the snowplow. Please don't hit the buses. Please, Lord, don't hit the buses. According to Metro Schools, the special needs students were on their way to school when they got stuck on Apollo Drive. Protocol is to leave students on the bus unless it becomes unsafe. And they were left on the bus for four hours before parents came to pick them up. Neighbors in the area said they couldn't believe students were being sent to school in the first place. When we got up and saw how hard it was snowing and how covered our uh, uh, road was, uh, we were very surprised that Metro was not closed. Now, Metro School says that they were hoping the snowplow would be able to free those buses, but when they heard about the crash, they sent out a van to pick up those students. But by the time the van arrived, parents had already picked up those students. But the good news tonight is all the students, including in the whole district, made it home safely. Live in Antioch, Jessica Newton, News Channel 5.